Okay guys, how you doing out there? My name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal H Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain and so forth. You know, the other screens, the Fusion Silver, Fusion Black, and the Platinum 4K Cinema Screens, which are freaking amazing. All right, so anyway, um, this is, but the last video was supposed to be my last video, but this will be my last video for today um, because um, uh, I have a lot of people on my forum sites that are asking me the Lumen abilities of these screens of the black screen now we already stated that the um the um the uh titanium uh, 4k gold and the ag47 can be used with projectors as low as 200 lumens i'm going to be showing you guys the lumen test that i'm about to do right now uh for the um the nano black screen now this is the future tech 4k nano black technology screens this is a black version of the future tech screen as you can see it is different in the demonstrations that i've uh, displayed it is different from an everyday black screen um, so what we're going to do in this demonstration and sorry if you hear a power drill going off in the background or saw my next door neighbor they're working on renovating their house so you might hear that in the video so you know it happens all right so let me show you how extreme when i say we do our tests we do extreme testing over here now what you're seeing right here is you're seeing the sheet right there in the middle let me come over and unplug the 500 watt bar light so you can see this better okay so i get the bar light unplugged so what you're seeing right here is this is a, a large sheet is a black screen we painted um we got the paint from amazon it is a high contrast black screen uh this is to show that the uh future tech 4k screen can produce a brighter uh um, light level of whites and colors than the average black screen and still maintain insane contrast levels so imagine if you have a black screen that is basically brighter than the color black itself see how insane that is so pretty much like i said with the eight with the 47 ag the screen is silver but can produce a white level that is brighter than white well this black screen can produce white levels that are better than any black screen i guarantee on the market and not only do that maintain perfect contrast levels so as you can see we have a black screen next to a black screen you're not gonna see a lot of people doing demonstrations like that and add insult to injury we have a 500 watt bar light to the top of the screen which i'm about to plug back in all right so on top of that consider the fact we have our everyday light plenty of light in the environment nice and bright we have the measuring tape out I'm going to show you why. So we'll come over here real quick. We are 13 feet from the screen right there. See that? And we're using a mini projector at 200 lumens, 720p. These projectors are battery packed. I'm charging mine right now. This projector is 200 lumens, 720p at 13 feet back from the screen. 500 watt bar light. And this is a black screen versus a black screen. So this is the nano black technology screen versus a black uh, um, uh, screen paint mix that uh, Amazon sells. So this is just to show you that when we do the demonstrations and people make statements by saying that, hey, look, screen's going to fade. You know what I mean? When you turn the lights on, our screens don't have that problem. All right. So I'm going to remove this right now. Also, too, you got to watch out. When you're watching people doing demonstrations on these mini projectors, you know, it's important that they have a measuring tape to show how far back the projector is sitting. Now, look at this right here. On a 200 lumen projector, 720p, this is the um, Nano Black technology screen by um, Future Tech. Now, look at that compare. It's actually brighter than the black screen. And this is with the 500 watt bar light. Look at the white wall. And look at the screen. All right, now watch this. Come over here. I'm going to grab a snow demonstration. Grab my snow demonstration here and hit it. There we go. Look at this snow demonstration. Look at this. 
on 200 lumens, 13 feet back, 500 watt bar light taped to the screen, fully lit environment, and look at that screen. And that screen is laying against another black screen. So you got people that are shy away from demonstrations like this. They won't be able to back up their product. We can back up our product over and beyond on what the technology can do. Now mind you, the requirement for these screens are probably going to be around 2,000 lumens uh, and up. That's what the requirement is going to screen. So the screen can produce more light than the average screen. The average black screen can produce more light. So the requirements probably for these screens are going to be probably around 2,000 lumens, maybe 500 lumens. We don't know yet, but this is just to show you how powerful this black screen is. Now, mind these screens can produce a a um, a, a brighter white levels, brighter colors, and still maintain perfect contrast even on a um, on a black surface and outproduce outperform sorry the average black screen. We're doing this 13 feet back on a 200 lumen projector 720p fully lit environment with the 500 watt bar light and that's one thing you have to watch out when you look at these demonstrations you have to look at the back of the wall where the projection screen is sitting because it'll be dark back there you know what i mean and on top of that look at where the measuring tape is how far is that mini projector sitting back now in the next video tomorrow I'll be using the 2000 Lumen NEC VT595 projector, 720p, 600 by 800 res. That will be in the next demonstration right there. But that just gives you a good idea on how powerful these screens are. And like I said, it's 200 lumens, so that's pretty impressive for 200 lumens. And you're talking about 13 feet back with a 500 watt bar like fully lit environment on a black surface. And mind you, the black surface itself is sitting, laying against another black surface, which is a screen paint. Uh, we got over on Amazon and just look at this. Wait a minute. Let me uh, hit the lights too. Sorry about my messy environment, people. So, got the lights out. Well, we still got that 500 watt bar light in the middle of the screen, so let's remove that too. Okay. There you go. That's how bright those black screens are. This gives you an idea how magnificent these things are. Like I said, if you're gonna you gotta do demonstrations, you have to back up what the product can do. You have to be the backup that the screen can perform in all different forms of stressful environments. And you know, 200 lumens that far back on a, on a projector and the screen still looks magnificent, magnificent. That's a pretty powerful screen. And the screen is laying against another screen paint. Screen paint mix. We got off Amazon. And it's the, our, our, our technology screen is laying right against it. All right. Now come out of here really quick. Just, just grabbing some videos really quick for you guys. All right. I'm going to grab something with some blues.
Now you see how powerful that screen is? This is how powerful nanotech technology is. It's a black screen that is producing blue levels better than a black surface itself. This is on 200 lumens, 16, actually, sorry, 13 feet back. I'll do one at 16 feet back. say anymore. As for those of you who have been asking us about, hey, turn the lights out, we want to see the difference between the screen with the lights out, well look at that screen right there. Now that's, that's a black screen versus a black screen. For anyone out there who feels the need to send me a, uh, a comment on my video and saying, hey, what, what's the difference between the, uh, the nanotech, the nano black tech technology screens versus an anybody else's black screen? Well, there you go right there. this let's go grab come out of here look at this now, throw the lights on Sorry about my messy background. Two hundred lumens, thirteen feet back, five hundred watt, five hundred watt bar light taped in the screen. As a matter of fact, I'll go farther than that. I'll take my light off right there. I want the screen to fall over there. Take that off. Put that right in the center of my screen. Tell me what you see. That's how powerful these screens are. 20 feet back, 200 lumens. That's the power drill I was telling you about that goes up from time to time. Okay. All right. Let's check in the video time, see if I got enough time here. shows you exactly how powerful these screens are. Now think about it. We're 13 feet back. 200 lumen projector. And we're doing this in a fully lit environment. And the screen is 